If you want to pack every single Euros and Copa America path to glory, make sure you follow this method to give yourself the best chance. As I said, this is only a method. NEA really just pick who they want to give path to glory, so I can't guarantee you do pack them. But this method is going to give you a very good chance. I just wanted to get that out of the way early, because last time I did one of these videos, Noah's Globe was not loving it, because he, he logged in and he didn't get his free Mbappe. I'm sorry, I can't just give cards out like that, otherwise the game would be really boring. So this is the best chance you're going to get a packing one. Alright, just so you're aware, this is an absolute grind and it's going to take a lot of effort, but if you're willing to do it, then you want to start in the SBC section, and the first SBC you want to do is this 89 overall exchange. This is how you're going to get all your plays so you can recycle it, and eventually you're going to pack Path to Glories. You're not... These exchanges aren't really going to give you the path of glory. It's the other SBCs that are going to do it. But this is a good starting point. So basically, you want to use every single special you don't use and 89 rated gold cards. Except for Team of the Weeks and Team of the Seasons. Because they're a bit more expensive. Because right now, I'm pretty sure Team of the Seasons are up about 40k. So just say you have these random scales. You have this ginger Donny. Make sure you don't use him because he is 40k. Hold on to him for as long as you can. Because who knows, maybe EA will release a ginger only Evo one day and he will skyrocket and be the best card there. Jesus have souls! But no, Team of the Seasons are 40k because they're used in every other SBC. So you pretty much just want to use gold cards or any other specials that don't make your team anymore, except for Team of the Weeks and Team of the Seasons. So I'll just use this Ruben Diaz to start with because I don't use Ruben Diaz, obviously, because he's got about 60 pace, and I didn't even use him in October, so I'm not going to use him in June. So once you exchange your 89 rated, in my case it was that 89 rated Ruben Diaz card, you want to go to the store and obviously open that exchange pack so you can get some golds into your club so you can recycle them. If you don't have any 89s in your club, I don't know what to tell you. You can buy them. They're about 20k in the market. I'll pop them pretty sure you can get them for. Just play some games first so you can get some coins. I assume most of you guys watching this have some coins in your club. But this exchange pack, you don't expect anything good. Belgium, if we get Thibaut Courtois, that'll be a bonus. We don't. We get Castiles. So at least it's an 84. Obviously, 84 is not going to do anything for anyone. But it's some good fodder to put back in the club so I can recycle into further SBCs down the line. All you're focusing on pretty much is the 51 golds you're going to get from this. The 14 rares or whatever it is. I've got 26 dupes because I have a lot of golds ready for this method. I'm not just bare base. I have people in my club. So you want to obviously swap your dupes around. I'll, I won't show you guys this. I'll come back once all my dupes are swapped around. All right, so I've swapped around all my dupes, and it's up to you how efficient you want to be. If you want to keep every single player and do no man left behind, I would probably recommend that. It depends how, how lazy you get. I normally get pretty lazy and just discard all my dupes. But make sure if you have Janina Minj dupe, do not discard her because she is my favorite player in the game. Make sure you recycle her. You better do that. But it's up to you how efficient you want to be. If you want to put all these cards back into the SBC I'm about to show you, then go do that. If you want to discard a few, most of you, I assume, won't have 26 dupes. Your clubs will be a little bit more empty than mine. But yeah, it's just up to you how efficient you want to be. But the SBC you want to do next after you get those dupes or the new cards, whatever they are, you want to put them into this 81 plus player pick because these are absolutely crack and you probably might get a part of the glory out of them. You want to build as many as you possibly can from the players you have in your club. Go to newest because of that exchange. You want to use them players you just got. So I'm going to use the dupes. I can't remember who it was. I'll just use whoever because I am not going out of my way in front of you guys to just use all the dupes I got. I assume these probably were mostly duplicates. Santi, comma, center. Finish off my 81 plus player pick. Yeah, but build as many as you want. As many as you can, pretty much. As many as you can be bothered to build. Just do that. I'm going to build one here because I'm just showing you what to do. And then you want to open this 81 plus player pick, obviously. Or the, how many you want to build in a row. It's up to you. Whatever you want to do, just do that. And you just want to open it. Oh, I did use all dupes. That's quite smart for me. But look, I get 83 Ericsson. So not exciting, but 83s are useful in some other SBCs. So after the player picks, now is where we get to, in my opinion, the SBC is going to give you the most chance of packing a path to glory. Let me show you now. I'm going to upgrades here. Not on this page. This one, this 85 plus time 5 upgrade. This requires an 85 rated squad with a team of the week and a team of the season. That's where the 83s are going to come in clutch. You're going to want to do this 83 plus team of the week player pick with all your 83s and your 82s, 84s. Because you do need two 84s for this and an 82 rated squad. So that's just two 84s and nine 81s. This one's an 83 rated squad with one 85. So it's one 85, I think four 83s and the rest 82s. So just use your lower end cards into that. And once you get a team of the week, you want to put in this 85 times 5 upgrade, 
which is gonna just be an 85 rated score. So it's pretty easy. Out of the player piece, you're gonna get a lot of 85s. And once you do this once, you can just recycle. You're gonna get at least five 85s, obviously, because it's an 85 times five. And you just keep putting in, and you can do this three times a day. So make sure you do this every day, because in my opinion, this is gonna give you the most chance of packing a path to glory. And yeah, all the high-end players you pack are over 89, the 90s, the 88s, under 89, because you only want to focus on the 89 exchange. That's the best one, in my opinion, at least. You want to go to the player SBCs, all the upgrades, it's up to you, and you can complete any of these players you want. You can have Luis Diaz, Joe Gomez. Why are all Liverpool players SBCs, EA? I didn't realize that. You want to do Bradley Barcola, because he plays for France, and he doesn't play for Liverpool, and France have a good chance in the Euro, so he's going to get upgraded a lot. Or you can do some of these upgrades, like the Icon Player Pick. If you want to have some fun, just do this Icon Player Pick. Why not? You can do all the Team of the Season upgrade. I'm pretty sure they're all still out. I've just done most of them. Yeah, you can do the Ligue 1. You can have your chance at Mbappe. The Weekly 1, Mbappe. The Ligue you might get June. You never know. Ultimate, Mbappe. Yeah, just do all these if you want to have some fun. Do this upgrade as well. 84 plus times 7. It's just going to give you more and more chance of packing a path to glory. But that's pretty much the way... The easiest way, in my opinion, I've said in my opinion a lot this video, but yeah, that's the best chance you're going to have of packing all the Path to Glory is currently in EAC 24. Just grind the hell out of the game. I'm sorry, there's no easier way. You just have to play the game. Technically, the easiest way is buy some fever points and just load up all the store packs. I would never advise that, but once again, I am not your bank advisor. So you can do whatever you want. Just don't buy fever points, please. But yeah, that's going to be the end of this video. Make sure you follow this method and comment down below all the best players you pack using this method. And that's going to be all from me. So leave a like on the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And until next time.